Jira software is the number one software development tool used by Agile teams. It was built with Agile teams in mind, and millions use it every day to plan, track, and release world-class software. This demonstration will highlight Jira software's key features and showcase how teams use it to build great products. So let's get started. Jira software contains powerful tools and features for every phase of the software development lifecycle. Great software begins with great planning, and the first step in great planning is having one place to manage the team's backlog. A prioritized, stacked ranked set of items that have been properly broken down can then be used to estimate scope and ensure accurate sprint planning. The visualization of work in progress on boards is the most popular way for teams to collaborate on work items and move things to done as quickly as possible. Whether the team works in Scrum, Kanban, or a mixed methodology, boards raise the visibility of work and keep everyone on the same page. The true definition of done is releasing quality code to end users. For most Agile teams, the best measure of progress and success is seeing working software in action. So for teams releasing early and often, a real-time overview of the health and status of upcoming releases is crucial. But these three key phases of Agile development wouldn't be complete without a set of complementary reports. The best teams constantly reevaluate priorities and strive to improve. So the best Agile tooling needs to monitor team activity and generate reports that give the team visual data in real time. These four steps of software development are what inspired the project experience in Jira software. From planning, to tracking, to releasing, to reporting, access to everything a software team needs is in one place. The end result is quicker access to the right information at the right time for every member of the team, bringing the entire team together like never before. With Jira software's sidebar, everything a software team needs is only one click away. The sidebar can also be personalized with links to useful assets the team needs, from Confluence product specs, to hip chat rooms, to Bitbucket repositories. Everything a software team needs to ship great code is easily accessible. But Jira software's sidebar isn't the only thing that can be customized. Like everything in Jira software, from the core workflow management system to its Scrum and Kanban boards, Jira software was built to allow software teams to fine-tune their setup as they determine the best way to work together. Since every team is made up of individuals, and no two teams work exactly the same way, iterative improvement is in the DNA of every great Agile team. Jira software was designed to be the most flexible and customizable tool for teams of every shape and size. Let's begin in the backlog. This section of Jira software was made for teams to work together on defining and breaking down user stories and issues. A backlog that is co-curated by team members is one that builds a shared understanding, helping them align on vision and execute faster. Teams start by creating epics and then breaking these epics down into issues that individual contributors can work on. Many teams typically begin with multiple epics, which represent features that need to be built. Then each epic is broken down into smaller items, such as user stories and issues. Next, teams iterate until every issue in the epic is sufficiently broken down to a level where it can be accurately estimated. This level of detail also allows for more clarity when it comes to the story's requirements. Very often, the breakdown process reveals non-essential interpretations of requirements that can then be deprioritized. Our recent study of over 5,000 Agile projects found that teams that released often tend to have an average of 12 epics represented in their backlog. This indicates a number that provides sufficient depth and visibility into what's coming up next in the release plan. The advantage of dividing work items into epics is that teams can have a balance between current work and longer and larger term initiatives. With this visualization, prioritizing the most important issues and stories is as simple as dragging and dropping items in the backlog. In addition, teams can create versions that include the various features they are working towards. Here, team members can see how the backlog is taking shape, with epics and versions providing a high-level view of where the team is spending the most time and energy. Overall, in a big stack rank, it's easy to see what the team is setting out to achieve. Once the backlog is broken down and well estimated, team members can start organizing the work and distributing it across the software team. Different teams have different ways of prioritizing work. Let's start with Scrum. 
Scrum teams can create a sprint right from the backlog and then drag the work the team has committed to right into that sprint. Jira's software defaults to two-week sprints, which is in line with the most popular sprint cadence. However, teams can easily determine a sprint length that works best for them. In our study of Agile projects, we discovered that the average number of issues in any given sprint is 30, highlighting the huge importance of properly breaking down issues during the sprint planning process. We also observed that teams with good release cadence achieve an average of 73% of their planned issues. The takeaway is that these teams aren't lowballing their estimates. Completing 100% of the work in a given sprint may sound ideal, but the best Agile teams continue to stretch themselves to achieve bigger and better things every sprint. For newly formed teams, it can take three or four sprints to get an accurate read of velocity, which is the average number of story points the team completes each sprint. Once an average velocity is established, this number can be used to provide a benchmark for how long it will take the team to hit their goal. An average velocity enables the team to determine whether they have the right mix of scope within a given budget during the sprint planning process. Once the sprint is running, team members swarm on the board, picking up issues and working through them. Feature branching is highly recommended for this process, as it provides a direct connection between an issue and the code that implements it. By pairing Jira software with Atlassian's code source management tool, Bitbucket, a developer can hit the Create Branch button from any issue and begin working on it immediately. This automatic branch creation will then populate the correct fields and create a permanent link between the issue in Jira software and the engineer's work in the source code. When Jira software is linked with the team's code repository, the entire team can get real-time information on what's happening in the code through the development panel on every ticket. The development panel shows the real-time status of commits, reviews, pull requests, build statuses, and other relevant deployment information. Once the team has determined a steady velocity, getting an idea of how long it will take to burn through the agreed-upon scope is easy. But Agile teams also need to respond to change, so Jira software includes features that help team members deal with scope creep, even midway through a sprint or release. Scope creep is inevitable for any Agile team. Teams that release early and often get feedback from customers on what they've shipped. This feedback is valuable and many times needs to be incorporated into the team sprint. This is where Jira software's reports, like the release burndown chart, come in handy. Unlike Scrum teams, Kanban teams have a continuous flow of issues across a board. There are no sprints, no set start and end dates. Kanban teams take items off a prioritized backlog and work on them one at a time. For Kanban teams, it's especially important to break work items into small pieces to get an accurate idea of throughput. Kanban teams elect to limit work in progress as a means to achieve higher overall efficiency. Jira software not only shows the number of issues in progress, but has a built-in column constraints that will go red when the amount of issues being worked on at one time is exceeded. Jira software also has a default swim lane for Kanban users called Expedited. This swim lane picks up issues with the highest priority setting to reflect times when the team needs to swim onto a burning issue. The control chart in Jira software complements Kanban development nicely. It shows an overall average cycle time, a rolling average, and a time-based view of the cycle time of all issues. Teams can zoom in and look at classes of issues with similar cycle times, and outliers where the cycle time is very quick or very slow. Teams can then use this information during retrospectives as a way to help improve performance over time. But Jira software boards can be modified to help teams visualize information just the way they want it. Using Jira software's query language, JQL, team members can create and edit filters on each board. While JQL opens the door to almost endless board flexibility, these filters are most often used to see various streams of work, cross-project views, and work items from other projects and boards. Swim lanes can be used to provide an alternative way to group work in progress in horizontal rows across the board. Teams often do this by story, assignee, component, or queries powered by custom JQL filters. Jira software's custom cards feature allows teams to bring up to three distinct fields on the backlog, active sprint, or Kanban board, enabling team members to see the most important information at a glance. For example, due date, a component, or an epic. Quick filters enable teams to create a custom view of their board using JQL. 
Some of the most popular filters include recently updated, issue types, labels or component-based filters, and assignees. Getting issues across the board and into the done column in a sprint or Kanban iteration is important. But done issues still require one more major step, deployment. This is where Jira Software's Release Hub helps software teams ship the value they've created to customers. Release Hub can be accessed in the Release section of the sidebar. Within the Release section, teams can see all of the versions that have been created for that particular project. By default, the Release section will only show unreleased versions, or the versions that are still being worked on. But teams also have access to past released versions if they need them. Clicking on a version will open the Release Hub, where team members can zero in on the health of a particular release, the scope at hand, and any delivery risks. A summary of release targets, start and end dates, time remaining, and a high-level breakdown of the status of outstanding issues are all in one place. Prior to the release, team members often double-check issues that have been marked as done. Jira Software makes this process easy by pulling developer tool artifacts right into the dashboard. Team members can see, at a glance, what's happening in the code and investigate anything that seems inconsistent or not ready for production servers. And this is where the Warnings tab comes in. Jira Software is designed to monitor inconsistencies in the code and proactively warn the team if something is broken or did not go through the proper review process. This automatic monitoring can save the team countless detailed issue-level reviews. Release Hub's proactive warnings not only save time, they also enable teams to hop on problematic items as soon as possible and when the context of the work is still fresh in their mind. An 11th hour fire drill usually means the delay of a release, but Jira software is built to help teams avoid this fate. By integrating with all of the developer tools the software team is already using, Release Hub gives teams an automated way to check for problems and ensure everyone knows that done issues are really done and ready for deployment. The best teams release early and often, and with confidence. Jira software makes this process easier and more stress-free than ever. And when the release date comes, builds can even be triggered and monitored without ever leaving the product. I hope you enjoyed this demonstration. It's just the tip of the iceberg on all of the power and flexibility built into Jira software. See what Jira software can do for you and your team by starting a free trial today. Go to atlassian.com slash Jira software to get started.